Our luscious Betty Crocker Devil's Food Cake recipe incorporates the ease of using a premix with some traditional elements like strong black coffee. So, indulge in these rich complex chocolate and coffee flavors. The recipe is incredibly easy to make and will take you less than an hour. We guarantee that you won't regret it. What is a Devil's Food Cake? This cake is a type of chocolate cake, but that is a lot richer in flavor and texture. It differs from regular chocolate cakes because of the addition of baking soda to the recipe. What is this recipe made of? Our Betty Crocker Devil's Food Cake recipe is made using strong black coffee to give it that much needed traditional richness. What do you need to make this recipe? Ingredients for the cake. One box Betty Crocker Devil's Food Cake Mix. Half a cup of canola oil. Half a cup of water. Half a cup of strong black coffee. Three medium eggs. Ingredients for the chocolate fudge frosting. Half a cup of salted butter softened. One cup of unsweetened cocoa powder. Four and a half cups of powdered sugar. Half a cup of milk. One and a half teaspoons of vanilla extract. Chocolate shavings. Step by step. Step 1. Line the cake pans with non-stick baking paper. Then, preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. After that, place the cake mix inside a large mixing bowl. Make sure it is lump-free. Create a well on the inside and add the oil, water, coffee, and eggs. Whisk together the ingredients until you have a smooth and uniform batter. Step 2. Pour the cake batter into the prepared lined baking pans. Then, bake the cake for roughly 25 to 30 minutes. They have finished baking once the testing needle or toothpick comes out completely clean. Afterward, remove them from the oven and allow them to cool. And, carefully loosen the sides and place them on a cooling rack to cool completely. Step 3. Place the butter in a medium saucepan and allow it to melt completely. Then, add the cocoa powder and whisk it until you get a thick paste. Then, transfer this mixture to a large mixing bowl. Whisk the paste at a low speed while adding powdered sugar and milk. Then, add the vanilla extract. Afterward, beat the frosting until it becomes creamy. Step 4. Once the layers are completely cooled, Place them one by one onto a cake board or stand. Top it with a thick layer of chocolate fudge frosting. Finally, garnish the cake with chocolate shavings and serve within four days. Tips and tricks. If you don't like the flavor of coffee in the cakes, you can substitute it with regular water instead. You can also substitute the eggs with applesauce or flax eggs. Don't use bananas or any other egg substitute that has an overly strong flavor. To level the cakes, simply measure out the needed height around the entire cake. You can mark the height by inserting toothpicks into the sides. Then, slice the cake using a sharp bread knife. You don't have to level both cakes, but we do recommend at least doing one. If you liked this video don't forget to like and subscribe.